having a super day. My name is Brian Barczyk, and this is Kevin McCurley. I hope you die. <laughs> no, I'm, gonna... <laughs> I'm, I'm not going to cut that out. That's yeah, awesome. That's good. Right. Right. Thumbnail, Kevin. There you go. Hi, everyone. Look at Brian's doing. Can you not do that more? Hey, everybody. I'm Brian Barczyk, and I'm super excited to be here. Where am I? Have a great day. Do a su super kindness to somebody. Do a super kindness to somebody. Yeah, yeah. I do want that. Hey, everyone. Everybody. Do a super kindness to someone. <laughs> Make today a great day. Brian, I think you kind of get the gist oh my gosh, of what it's I so mean. Good. It's so good, yeah, because now any kind of waste or anything like that, you just slide it out, clean that tub, slide it back in, you're good to go. I love the curves on this, sealed. I mean, that's perfect, dude. You were curved. This is what I was doing the past this couple like, weeks. Yeah, this is, this is perfect. Curves. This is so good. Brian, Brian it's like, like a good, curves, solid dude. week and a day of curves. <laughs> he goes, what? I like curves. curves. <laughs> well, I can't get the kind of caging that I want. Um, Animal Plastics is so slammed, but we've been yeah. talking about coming up with some of my designs for the market. Yeah. But uh, until now, um, good thing I'm a pretty decent craftsman. No, these are nice, man. You did a really good job. So that's oh. an Argentine. So this is an IMG anatheristic hypo albino wow. male. And you're going to go with it to an Argentine? Yeah, well, I'm, just, I'm dying to it's see how the IMG, IMG with, the, the Argentine. with Argentine. I, I want to see that. So that's just like one of the like, little fun things I want to do. Oh my gosh, I think that was That's cool. Because that's what I always thought about. I always always reminded me a little bit of Oxygen. Yeah, for sure. Oh, dude. You have no idea how excited I am about the snake. <laughs> I mean, this is, oh my gosh. This is crazy cool. This was one of my dream snakes, dude. Dead serious. Like when I was a kid, I used this to. This is a very rare animal. snake. Yeah, this is. Uh, I mean, when we, when I was a kid, I remember seeing uh, in the the uh, Merton's book, the the uh, uh, what was it even called. Uh, snake breeding or snakes, living snakes of the world, I think it was called. Oh my God, the oh, Bible. Yes, 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 it was yes, our yes. Bible. <laughs> I'm sorry. And uh, the Malagasy's were like. I mean, because, you know, obviously, Doomerals were awesome and stuff like that, but, but to see something like this, man, oh, my gosh. This is crazy. So man. this is different than a Doomerals boa for some people you, for you to understand. Um, what's very interesting about something like this is there is no importation of any of these boas, being Sanzinia, Doomeral boas, Madagascar ground boas, which what, what this is. You can't get them. So all the stock that we have here in the country from long ago is all we get to work with. Yeah. And uh, there's such a plight what's going on in the ecosystem of Madagascar. These animals are just being lost uh, so rapidly. And do you realize that there's less than 1% of 1% of their original forest? And they're Jeez. just like almost, it, it, I can't even comprehend things yeah, like that. Yeah, it's gone, it's just gone. And all those animals and, but yeah, these guys, my understanding is, is that like these, these were more common in Madagascar than Dumeril's boas. But yet, they didn't get exported, so they're super uncommon here, right? I mean, this is like maybe the fourth Malagasy ground boa I've seen in my entire life in person. I have two breeding pairs, oh my and they have some of the biggest babies. So they don't huge have babies. They don't big, have many, yeah, exactly. but they have yeah, yeah. huge babies. One yeah. of them had only one. Oh my! It had like one subadult. <laughs> yeah, that's what it is. They're born like three times the size of a Dumeril's boa. It's, but oh my gosh, that and that collar on that, dude. You know that is crazy cool, man. Sanzinia tree boa. So this that is once is a again big one. Dude. Yeah, she's she's my big Look at girl. That head, man. So the male is a mandarin phase. Yep. And he's just down hiding in the water. These are a little tricky to breed. Yeah, I've heard. You yeah. really kind of got to get them touch her body. You can. Oh, she's I got, cool. I got she's her temperature cool. down, and uh, she's actually full of follicles right yeah, now. Yeah, you can see she's starting to descend a little bit. So, wow, red Hold babies. It. They come out just beautiful red. Oh my God, my pleasure. Look at the again. face. You want to get definitely some. Some B-roll of that thing's face. Wow, this is incredible, man. Let's just pull it right up and over. Here you go, baby. Wow, what a snake, man. 
Look at that. It looks like a viper, doesn't it? It does, dude. It looks like real. a venomous snake. I mean, almost uh, you know, similar to like a main Shang viper or something yeah, like that. Yeah, yeah. You know, it's not quite as tricked out as yeah, 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 exactly. <laughs> oh, God. But I mean, it's like so a, it's a, a structure. structure. The structure. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I mean, the, the the face there, they're basically very, very. You get a calm. Look at those freaking pits. They're very, very yeah. sweet. So I, I'm obsessed with uh, tree boas and pythons. Yeah. Um, the one reason why I like, I love obviously green tree pythons and, and whatnot, but I love the tree boas because the babies are larger. Yep. They're a bit easier to work with as far yeah. as getting the feed because yeah. I've, I've, you know, yeah, man, green the, trees the green tree pain. pythons can just be yeah. a, a they'll, serious they'll break struggle. You, yeah, they'll break your heart. They'll break your heart, yeah. for sure. But yeah, not many people breed Sanzinia. You you know? can't even find them. Yeah, you can never, I mean, yeah. There's, That's yeah. incredible. Especially the green face. Snarfles, who's a little fat. Oh my. Snarfles is going into shed. But Snarfles could be one of the most famous snakes. And maybe Lilith might be. Do you know, I, I literally have a Snarfles. I have two stickers on my computer. One of them is Snarfles. Yeah. Believe it or not, I actually have a Snarfles sticker. I love this dude. I want Remember, to you guys sticker. totally clickbaited me, by the way, with the whole. What happened to Snarfles? Video. Oh, really? Yeah. Who, is that? Who is that? I learned it from you, dude. What do you think did it? Yeah, yeah. You guys, <laughs> you guys clickbaited me. I was like, no, not Snarfles. But uh, you guys. Well, we were getting comments all the time. They thought we were hiding her because, you know. Well, it's funny how that happens, right? Like, if you don't show something in a video for like a week, yeah. you're like, what happened to Snarfles? It's Why are you not Snarfles? Hey, I get so many people that like want his own Instagram thing. Why don't you let That's Brian have the head there so we can get some screenshots of the guy with the head? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I am, yeah. I am, yes, they feed me way too much, guy. I'm always eating and now I need time for loving. So it's a sign, you know, very soon my testosterone is going to kick in and I'm not going to be interested in eating. It's only going to be breeding and loving the women. That means dates, like sometimes two, three dates a night. Oh my gosh. Oh man. yeah. A Do you think stunt. it's completely cringe when he talks like that over Snarfles? Uh, what do you, like, dude, that's I can't help that. I think it's good. Oh yeah? I think it's good. It's, yes. He's, yeah, it's, you know, I mean, he, he, he needs to off his medication probably, but uh, Snarfles, but other than that, Snarfles on Snarfles, 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 Snarfles look fat to you guys? Uh, I don't think he looks fat. Why would he look fat? Ooh, he feels little, very so dope with Snarfles. He's a little, yeah. he's a little pudgy, But he is, he is shedding and uh, so Brian knows all about Snarfles. Yeah, I so saw him he was a little guy. Yeah, Brian met Snarfles when Snarfles was a baby and I was kind of hiding it. Yeah, I know. You were like, do you think, I think you said like something like, do you think that this is like, like going to be a scaleless or something? Like, and you're like, <laughs> scaleless do you head. Think you have scaleless head. Yeah, I actually, that's like, like, exactly. Oh, Andy, Andy was saying that. Yeah. That was, that was it, but it was kind of like the, the secret. But he's so cute. He is cute, man. And, uh, he's got the derpiest face in the world. It's adorable. But he's also, he's a, like, a super social snake. He loves, if you let him just crawl around, he gets so excited. That's why he's doing all this stuff. Oh, yeah. he, just, he loves to just crawl around. Is, but, is this an animal you would have in your zoo just because the way he looks? Oh, yeah, 100%. I mean, just because it's, you know what? It would create curiosity, right? People would come in and go, what is going on with snarfles? And then you can, you know, teach them. As soon as someone's curious about something, then they're open to be taught, right? So, uh, no, snarfles is great, man. I, I'm a huge fan. Little kids love snarfles. Oh, my God. And uh, they probably don't necessarily love snarfles content because snarfles is a little bit single-minded. I've it's heard, always I've heard that about snarfles. It's always about the women, guys. <laughs> <laughs> that was the first time, like Brian's just, not said fun. anything. You know, like there's <laughs> really, I, I'll be honest with you, there is nothing to say. I mean, I know when to shut my mouth, and, and right now is that time. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's been fun filming you. Did you have fun while you were here? Oh my god, dude, seriously, this is this place. I, I've always loved coming here. And I will say this. Uh, I'm always impressed when I come here because there's so many great animals. Obviously, I love spending time with Kevin and his knowledge. But uh, things are really cool right now. Like you guys have added a lot of really dope animals in the last couple of years. It's it's shocking, just in the last even year since I've been here, the how much you guys have ramped up. This is Janet. This is my baby. It's my uh, my barn next girl python that I've been raising. I actually got her from Nerd about oh five gosh. and a half years ago. That thing is and ridiculous. She is the best. You have a boy for her. I just got a boy for her, so and you gotta breed these. I think next <laughs> season we're looking at uh, potentially making some really nice barn X scrub pythons. Oh man, that would be amazing. I mean, baby scrubs are ridiculous. Yeah, amazing. I mean, they're so. I mean, these guys are beautiful as adults, but as babies, next level. So, mm -hmm. so I can't wait till you have them for sure. Super Those are uh, beautiful. <laughs> Look at this thing. And, and, and there again, yeah, a lot of people think scrubbies and barn X and, and amethyst scenes are you know all aggressive animals, but you can see how unbelievably puppy dogs they are. They're. Uh, 
Oh my god. It, yes. Rob is just like the person in the building I can get an awesome thumbnail from no matter what. Like, look at him. Look at She's just like... <laughs> yeah, and you too. You give amazing faces, Brian, <laughs> and all of the... <laughs> oh, a bigger one. Okay, cool. Oh, here we go. Yeah. Oh. I, I wish I wasn't holding her now because the other one's more... Uh, it's going to eat Donnie. <laughs> <laughs> this is a, well, our male's even bigger. Yeah. Wow. So, this is a sibling to her. That's a sibling? Yeah. Oh my Check gosh. that out. Strong pythons are the coolest. They are crazy. Just I can't believe crazy. how chill it is, too. Yeah, though. they're um, so basically they can be a very reactive animal, but if you kind of work around it, one of the tricks with scrub pythons, uh, your eyes, just like reticulated pythons, mm -hmm. and um, you never grab them behind the head. So a lot of these animals, people, they might start out doing some uh, things for their own safety or just how they handle them, and they can have lifelong consequences. Right. Uh, about trust because she's not head shy at all because no. she's never been manhandled. Uh, when she's little, you can tolerate a couple bites. Uh, when they're bigger, you don't want to get no, bit. No, these are bad bites. <laughs> bad bites. They have uh, substantial teeth, but they are like velvet. Uh, these are not routinely bred. I used to breed southern scrubs, and uh, they were just, they weren't exactly what we wanted to do. Uh, they were beautiful, the babies are red. Yeah. But the Baronex and uh, Malukan scrubs, I, I really, you know, I love stuff like this, but this this is such a serious animal. That and they get kind of big. Head, yeah, it's almost Bolin-esque in yeah. a way. They just reclassified so, yeah. these guys in the same genus yeah, with Bolin's python, yeah, yeah. so. Yeah, they're they're like right up there. They got that big bulky head, yeah. those strong big muscles. Yeah, on the head. big giant scales, and I love the tail end of them too. Because if you look at it, it looks just kind of like a king cobra yeah. with the netting yeah, down yeah. the scalation. Yeah. Just Great. amazing, cool. amazing snake. Yeah. Try to look, look, look like you want to be like bites, right? Or is it the Are you or is shy? It, or is it this? I like or is it you have? I don't like to talk. Oh, Kevin, <laughs> Kevin, you're so fucking miserable. <laughs> I, t I hate life. I hate everything about these. Yes, you know, we're doomed. We're doomed. <laughs> you know, we fished out 96% of all the oceans since 1950. This is an outro. <laughs> this is an outro. <laughs> right? oh, it's a bloopers reel. <laughs> <laughs> okay. What? Okay. Okay. All right. Okay. Cool, so guys. We had a great time with Brian. Brian yeah. visited us for two whole days and it we packed in the videos. I want to thank okay. Jay. And Brian for being here and uh, being great guests. Uh, I learned a lot. They really are helping us on our social media. Donnie's uh, getting all sorts of uh, intel and I'm learning how to uh, behave myself and how be to happy. be a little bit better. Mm. Be but uh, one thing that's great is I have uh, a lot of respect for Brian. He's, he goes all over the place. He sees a lot of people's collections and he was, gets to look at my animals and I kind of watch how he expresses himself and, and you really can't fake that, and it means a lot to me when he's actually looking at my animals, and I'm getting feedback, what he actually thinks about what we're doing here at New England Reptile. He uh, was really great to my employees, so it's a little bit exciting to have somebody who's so well-versed in social media, and my guys got to meet him. They did little uh, little micro uh, introduction yeah, we vlogs. Fun, yeah, we had a lot of fun with them. But no, the place is amazing, Kevin. I mean, you know, first off, thank you for having me, and Jay, and I tell you what, Jay and I, and, uh, <laughs> and uh, it was it, it is true. I've traveled all over the place and and I've been to Kevin's place many times uh, you know over many years and it is still my favorite place to visit. I mean, I'm sorry to everyone else, but uh, it, it's the most diverse group of amazing animals in one place that you can go to. And, and he's definitely amazing. watched me come a long way from the yeah. early days. You should no. visit us more often then. Dude, I'm in. Cool. Yeah, he comes about once and bring year. Eric and, Chambers. And don't He's forget cool. to uh, start following us. Uh, we're going to get into Twitch, which <laughs> is basically we're going to start doing something. We're going to talk about... Hit that TikTok too, man. Yep. yep. Link and in the description. We have a shit bag day. Woo! Do a nice like to someone. Subscribe. Do, a, like do a super nice <laughs> to, do a nice to someone. someone. Do a nice to somebody. <laughs> Thank you for right. meeting me, Jay. Yeah, dude, it was great Thank meeting you too, bro. Are you going to hug me with the... Oh, I've never done that before. Thank you for, thank you for meeting me.